welcome back to my youtube channel and this is castle vlogs and today we'll be talking about numerical series test and letter of the alphabet as numbers and this is mathematics in the modern world so what is numerical series test these are a type of numerical aptitude test which requires you to find the missing number in a sequence this missing number may be at the beginning or middle but it's usually at the end so let us have an example of numerical series tests identify the missing number in the series first 4 8 16 and 32 of as what you have observed 4 8 so these are just a double numbers or each time the first is a 4 so we have to multiply it by 4 times 2, that is equal to 8. Next, we have 8 times 2, that is equal to 16. And 16 times 2, that is equal to 32. So therefore, 32 times 2, that is equal to 64. Alright, so let, this is, the answer is letter B. So this is the missing 64. For number 2, we have 4, 8, 12, and 20. So what is the missing? So in this case, we have to add. Okay, so we have to add this part. So the previous to the next number. So we have here 4 plus 8, that is equal to 12. So therefore, we have a 4 plus 8, that is 12. And we have 8 plus 12 that is equal to 20 so therefore we have 20 plus 12 that is equal to 32 okay so therefore the answer is 32 that's how we're going to identify the missing number in the series so we have to begin and we have to be observant about the series of numbers Next, we have here number 3, 54, 49, 30, blank, 39, and 34. So first, what have you observed about the series? In this series, we observe that it is being decreased by 5. Okay, so decreased by 5, so 54 minus 5, that is equal to 49. And 49 minus 5 so this is the missing so what is 40 49 minus 5 that is equal to 44 so 44 minus 5 that is equal to 39 and 39 minus 5 this is that is equal to 34 so therefore the missing is 44 so the answer is letter b all right that is all about number three so let's proceed with number four so we have three six eleven and eighteen so what is the pattern or the sequence all about so we have three six eighty six eleven eighteen so we have observed that we have added starting with three you have you have to add by two increase it by two so let's starting with three so we have plus three and plus five plus seven and plus nine so starting with three add it by two and you have to get for the next term in this case so we have here three plus three that is equal to 6 so add it by 2 so 3 uh, we have 6 plus what is 3 plus 2 that is equal to 5 that is 11 next we have 11 plus plus 2 that is equal to 7 that is 18 and 18 plus the next term is 9 so we have 27 so therefore the missing is 27 all right so we are now in number five so in number five 
So what have you observed about number five? So there are two uh, series here. First is that first is we have to multiply it by two. There are two categories here rather. So we have 14 and 28. Then after the one, you have to subtract it by eight, then multiply it by two and subtract it by 8 and multiply it by 2. So let's have the calculation. So we have here, so 14 times 2, that is equal to 28. So if we're going to have 28, subtract it by 8, so we have 20 times 2, that's equal to 40. So this one, this part. And again, we have to subtract it by 8. So 40 minus 8 that is equal to 32 and 32 times 2 that is equal to 64 again so we have to multiply it by 2 then subtract it by 8 multiply it by 2 and subtract it by 8 so therefore so uh, we have 32 64 okay 64 minus 8 so they have 56 so the other the answer is 56 okay so let's have number 6 5 6 7 8 10 11 and 14 so in this case so we have here there is an alternate functions here so we have 5 7 10 and 14 and the second one is we have 6 8 11 and a known so a known here so in this case we have 2 so 5 plus 2 that is equal to 7 added by 1 the interval so we have 7 plus 3 that is equal to 10 so there are 4 this is 14 so therefore this is plus 5 so to make it 19 so this is the first number 19 which is letter a but we have two questions here so two unknowns here unknowns here so therefore we have 6 8 11 so this is plus 2 that is equal to 8 plus 3 that is equal to 11 so therefore plus 4 to make it 15 so this is the answer is a is equal to 19 and C is equal to 15. So there, there are two answers because there are two unknowns here. Alright, so we have now in number 7. In number 7, we have 1 unknown, 4, 7, 7, 8, 10, and 9. In 6 and 7, uh, they have the same concept. Okay, so we have here 1, 7, 1, 7, 8, and 1, 7, 10, rather, 1, 7, 10, 1, 4, 7, and 10, this is 7, and 10, and the next part is the unknown, 7, 8, and 9. So we have here 1, 4, 7, 10. So we have here increases by 3. Okay. Increase it by 3. Here, increase it by 3. And by 3. And this one, so you have 9, 8, 7. Decrease it by 1. So therefore, the answer is plus 3. So we have 13. And this is 6. So 6, the first number is 6 and 13. So A and D. Okay, so we have here number, the next test, which is the letter of the alphabet as numbers. Another type of number series questions which appears in these tests involve the substitution of letters of the alphabet for numbers. For example, A is equal to 1, B is equal to 2, and etc. It may seem strange to consider this as a number series questions, 
but they do actually work in exactly the same way once you have changed them back into numbers. All right, so let's have letter of alphabet as numbers number one. Con continue number eight. Identify the next letter in the ser in the series. So B E H and K. So what have you observed about this part? There are two letters missing between each one. So what's the next number? So let's have first B. So there are two missing here. So B C D. Next is E. Two missing E F and G. And this is H. I and J, K, L and K, L, M. Then the next letter is N. So therefore, we could say that the next letter is N, T. So that's for number 8. For number 9, we have A, Z, B, Y. So in number 9, we have there are two interval sequence from A to B to A to Z and Z to A. So first we have here A, B, and the second one is Z and Y. So therefore, we can say that this is A, B, and C. So we have here that there are two interval sequences here from A to Z and Z to A. So for number 10, we have T, V, X, and Z. So in this case, we have miss each letter, miss a letter each time and look back. So you're going to have here first, so T, V miss one, T, U, and V, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z, A, and B. So that's how first means Y. So T, U, W, Y, and A. So therefore, the next one is B. Okay. So there is a missing letter each part. So and, lo and then lo looping back to a to Z. Okay, so we have here again T, U, this is the missing letter, V, the missing letter, X, the missing letter, Z, and looping back from the start A to Z. So next is B. Alright, so those are uh, the problems or examples for this part. So try this one at home. So look at the series. So we have a one to four questions and you have to make an explanations or solutions out of the topics. Okay, so you have to show your solution so that I could be able to uh, say that you are solving that one alone. Okay, so thank you so much for listening to this Casalican Vlogs and I hope everyone you enjoyed this moment and please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much.